behind you! Look out! You dumb, stupid, gullible fool! Drop the scissors. I am not going to jail. I'm not. You're just gonna have to kill me. Don't think I won't do this, Sharon. I'm taking you in to answer for what you've done. You and me both know that's not why you're taking me in. Where's my book? You have it. I know you do. And you ain't getting it. If I don't, I'm finished. Don't worry. I'll make sure all the major newspapers get a copy as soon as I've emptied the account. These people, you don't know who you're dealing with. Oh no, don't you understand? It's not my money! Paul, how could you do this to me? I know where that money comes from. Sharon told me everything. You don't know the half of it. You take her side over mine? Your own blood? I know she made you do this, Paul. Look, I'm giving you a get out of jail card here. Now give me the gun. After Nam, I swore I'd never hold one again. And you know that. Don't give me that flower power crap. Just give me the gun. If you listen to him, you're a fool. He'll put us both away. Oh, Paul, car keys. Let's go. Hurry. I know.
a feather with legs. I think it's because you're high. I know it's because I'm high. Don't you want to dance? Nah, I don't dance. I'm gonna go get a soda. Okay. person expected to show up asking for a flavor. Well, I'm full of surprises. Look, will you help me or not? What will he give me for it? Oh, man. You are so freaking tall from down here. What are you looking at? Dean, what are you doing? You know this guy? So what if I do? We go to school together. In Arizona. Well, whoop de doo doo fucking do. Now get out of my room, or get out of the party. Dean, please. I'm all right. Buddy, she's asking you to leave. Sorry if that hurt your feelings or something, but it's what she wants. Be a good sport. You can't win them all. I'll be at the car. <laughs> Still feel amazing? Dean, why did you follow me? I had that. You said he was your brother's friend. He was. We also went out a few times. I didn't tell you because... I don't know. I just didn't. I wasn't even into him. But you wanted to be alone with him. So I could get him to help us. Which, admittedly, he didn't. But I did snag this. So did the two of you... Uh, did you... Wait, are you jealous? him to find an old photo of my brother, and when he wasn't looking, I stole some cash. That's all. What about the fake ID stuff? Well, he won't help with that. He wanted too much. How much? A blowjob. <sighs> Just forget about it, okay? He's a fucking asshole. But he's not worth it. She told 
told me the truth. Maybe I should have. Look, I saw a campsite off the highway. I still feel pretty good. How about we go have our own after party? Yeah. All right. And I thought it was all potato farms. Something, ain't it? <sighs> You're not like the guys at school. The football players and the mathletes. The future farmers of America. You're different. I don't know. You're real somehow. Not trying to be. I don't know what it is, but when I look at you, I, I just feel happy, safe. I trust you, Dean. Look, I need to tell you something. My name's not Dean. It's Jay. Okay. And that house I said we robbed? It was Sheriff Romero's. Huh? I didn't know that till we got there. But Sheriff came home, we ran, got holed up at this motel on... Route 66. Oh, one of them. The family from the news. I didn't want to be there. It wasn't my idea. But the cops don't care about that. They're blaming me for all of it. Uh. Are you angry? It's... It's just a lot. Why did you tell me? Like you said, you trust me. And I trust you too. More than I trust anyone. Sorry, I... I don't know why I did that. Don't be sorry. That was nice. <sighs> Real nice. Maybe we can do it again when we get to Canada. Wait, we? What? You thought I was gonna miss out on all that maple syrup? I'm coming with you. Y you can't. Didn't you hear what I said? I'm wanted by the FBI. Dean? Or Jay, I guess? I haven't had a life in Two Rocks since the day my brother died. My dad's like this prison guard whose job is making sure I never make a friend, never take a risk. Every single week, I think I should just run the fuck away. Instead, I sit around in that stupid uniform helping Mima waiting for permission. Well, you know what? I don't need permission. This is my chance to become someone new. Do you not want me to come? Of course I do, but are you sure? You're gonna learn something. 
I can be really stubborn. Okay. Then let's go to Canada. Then let's go to Canada. <sighs> so, Jay, huh? Yeah, like a blue jay. It's nice. What's your last name? Holt. Holtz have been in Two Rock over 150 years. It sounds like you're proud to be part of that. I was, but that's over now. It's like you said, I make my own choices from here on out. Now, I'm finally free. All units, be advised. The teenager seen at 1281 Elmfield this evening is the same one being pursued by the FBI. Consider him armed and dangerous. Okay. I beat my record. Uh. 
forget something? Hmm? <laughs> Thanks. Aren't you in the undergraduate journalism program? I haven't seen you in a while. Uh, yeah. I haven't been coming to lectures much. Mm. Not really feeling it. Oh. Right. Look, that thing you were doing in the water. Can I ask what it's about? Holding your breath like that? Some people meditate. I sink to the bottom of a pool. One of these days I'm gonna get to two minutes. Wow, that sounds intense. Why do you do it? It's the only place I get any peace. Oh, that's... I should be getting home. Look, it's just... So, I had a friend in middle school. She was, like, infuriatingly perfect. Top of the class, captain of the soccer team. And one day, we're all on this field trip, and boom, she disappears. Gone. We then... I just know she'd have felt better if she knew there was someone ready to listen. Right. Maybe. Just ask for me. My name's May. With a Y. Got it. So, I talked to Mima. What? When you were changing the license plate, I called to check on her. Did you tell her any- No, no, I just wanted to hear her voice. Are you sure you're up for this? Huh? Hiking over the border? <laughs> I hate hiking. But, hey, guess it's time to be flexible. I'm gonna be a wanted criminal now. You're not a criminal. You're just helping a friend. Did you watch the O.J. trial? The what? <laughs> O.J. Simpson? All-American football player accused of murdering his wife because she's screwing some waiter? I don't really watch TV. Huh. Well, the point is, nobody's what they seem, you know? Like, <sighs> what are we capable of? Are we all just killers waiting for our switches to get flipped? What about kindness? <laughs> We're capable of that, right? See? The world needs more people like you. More on the manhunt for the Desert Dream Killers, who first robbed the Two Rock County Sheriff's House, then took shelter at a motel that turned into the scene of a... Wait, was that you? Yeah, but I don't want to hear. I do. Describe Jay Holt as an awkward, quiet high school dropout. Ugh, they say it like dropping out's a crime. Holt also has an accomplice, 16-year-old Vanessa Dorland, mm. who is assumed to be armed and dangerous. If you see either of these violent criminals, uh. please call 911 and make... Sorry, you got pulled into all this. 
I wasn't pulled. I chose. I just... I need a minute, okay? Sure. Okay. Okay, don't stress. We'll figure this out. Morning, you two. Everything okay, officer? Just running a sobriety checkpoint here, looking for any intoxicated drivers coming back from that River Palooza music festival. Were you there? No, sir. We're just passing through. Can I ask where you're coming from? We were in Arizona. <laughs> oh yeah? Because you have Montana plates. You go to school down there or something? We were visiting the Grand Canyon. You been? No, ma'am. Oh, you gotta go. We went all the way down to the river on the back of a mule. Mm -hmm. It's way nicer than the postcards. Uh-huh. Anyway, if I could just see your license and registration, you'll be on your way. Sure. Just a sec. Where is it? Hmm. Well, it's against the law to drive in Montana without a valid driver's license. I'm really sorry, officer. I'll need to run the plates. Dispatch, need you to run some plates for me? Montana, three, Papa, two, one, five, seven, Tango. Shit, he's gonna find out any second. What, again? Well, can't you run it manually? We need to get out of here. Look, I can explain. <sighs> Goddamn database is down again. There's a sneak peek of Y2K for you. All right. I'm gonna let you off with a warning. Next time. Bring your license along for the ride. I will, officer. Go on, get out of here. Pumpkin. Hey, Dad. How's the, um, new plane? Oh, you are gonna love it. So much quieter than the old one. So, um, are you okay? It was my birthday on Sunday, and you usually call. Oh, Dad. I'm sorry. It's just... The thing is, I... Don't tell me. Lecture's coming out of your ears. <laughs> I get it. So, how about I drop by campus tomorrow for lunch? That might be... tricky. Why? Everything's cool at school, right? To be honest, Dad, I'm not sure the program's right for me. 
What are you saying? You dropping out? You've been wanting to study journalism since the ninth grade. No, just weighing my options, that's all. Zoe, your mom's gonna yeah. flip. I know, but listen. You should call her. And then we need to discuss this together. Sorry. Uh, Dad, I gotta go. that. time. Come on. Think. Where did you put them? Joke, it's not funny. Uh, uh, hello? Hey, Grandpa. Zoe! I know it's late, but I, I could use a friendly ear right now. Do you mind if I come over? What kind of situation? Mr. Walker! I'll be there in ten. <sighs> it's like I told you, I can't have tenants damaging the building. And I told you, I didn't damage a damn thing. Mr. Walker, I really don't want to get into another argument. Oh. Hey there, Zeusy, old boy. Zoe, thank God you're here. <sighs> now, 
Please tell this woman I have a right to the quiet enjoyment of my own home. Huh. Quiet enjoyment? You vandalized your front door. Okay, slow down. What happened? Somebody broke in and stole my wallet. Uh, no. Hmm. You misplaced your wallet, and you broke your own front door. Zoe, someone was here. I saw him lurking in the shadows. Did he take anything else? Yes, my slippers. Oh, give me a break. Your grandfather wandered outside in his robe for the third time this month. When he realized he didn't have his keys, he broke the door to get back in. That is not true. I wanted some air, so I I took a walk and uh, and I I saw someone and uh, I, and then the next thing I know, I'm arguing with with Shelby here. That's not even my name. <laughs> yeah. Zoe, I know this is painful to hear, but your grandfather is declining. He needs a nurse or an assisted living oh, home. Oh God or... damn it! I don't need assisted anything. We obviously have very different interpretations of what happened. Still. Somebody will have to pay for that door. <laughs>